While we'd like to include them all, we only have room for 10. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today, we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Orange is the New Black characters. This is for the birds. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we'll be looking at the most memorable and most nuanced characters this show has to offer. Number 10. Piper Chapman Is that for me? In the grand scheme of things, Piper isn't exactly the show's most compelling character. However, as its primary protagonist, she garners more than her fair share of screen time. Actress Taylor Schilling has done an excellent job of creating a character that's both relatable and highly entertaining. When you say that everybody hates me, you're being a little hyperbolic, right? While she may not make the best decisions on an episode-to-episode -episode basis, she's still a lot of fun to watch. While there are plenty of awesome ladies and men to choose from, a list of the best Orange is the New Black characters wouldn't be complete without Piper. I hurt you too. Number 9. Alex Voss it's not a star. Say what you will about this character, but the fact remains that without her, Orange is the New Black as we know it wouldn't exist. It was Voss's relationship with a young Piper that served as the catalyst for the events of the show, as Voss was the one who got Piper tangled up in an international drug smuggling ring. Right now you're willing to overlook pretty much anything because ultimately you are just terrified of being alone. Portrayed by TV vet Laura Prepon, Voss is as manipulative as they come, which makes her one of the show's most captivating characters. While she may not always do or say the right things, her sharp wit makes her a blast to watch. Are you kidding me? Number 8. Lorna Morello I'm trying to get the heat going, but when I turn it up too high, a real bad smell comes out of the blowers. How can anyone not love Lorna? The fact that she's locked up has done little to dampen her spirits, and she acts as a ray of light in an otherwise dark setting. Sure, we found out that her supposed fiancé was actually just some dude she was stalking, but it only made her less of a caricature and more of a real person, one who, just like the best of us, has had a tumultuous love life. Lucky for Lorna, she put all that behind her and eventually married her pen pal Vince. You may kiss the bride! Oh my goodness. Tack on the fact that she has arguably the best accent on the show and you have one awesome character. You know, even though it took a lot of time and I had to go to the store twice, you are worth it. Number 7. Tiffany Pensatucky Doggett Do it taste like chicken? No, it tastes like an eagle. Great shows have the ability to turn villains into heroes, creating characters that'll make your blood boil one minute, only to have you overcome with sympathy the next. Pensatucky is the perfect example of this. While she was initially introduced as an antagonist, Pensatucky cleaned up her act in Season 2, leading to a heartbreaking revelation about her past in Season 3. I wanted to stop. I wanted to stop so bad. I wanted him to stop. While she may have started out as a walking stereotype for Appalachian Christians, Pensatucky has turned into a well-rounded and deeply moving character. She's come a long way since trying to kill Piper with a cross-shaped shiv. She devil. That's what you are. You're the devil. And I'm the angel of God. Number 6. Nicole Nikki Nichols What's the truth? What's the truth, huh? If Lorna has the best accent on the show, Nikki's is a close second. From season one onward, Nikki has been one of Orange is the New Black's most interesting characters. She has a deep understanding of how things work at Litchfield and isn't afraid to speak her mind when something doesn't seem right. You know, it's, uh, it's not cheating if you're in different zip codes, right? While she has had her struggles, being a recovering heroin addict in prison can't be easy, she's a good listener with a down-to-earth personality, which allows her to make friends with ease. Actress Natasha Lyonne did such a good job in the role that she was nominated for an Emmy in 2014. I'm very resourceful. Number 5. Suzanne Crazy Eyes Warren How come everyone calls me Crazy Eyes? What kind of list would this be without a shout out to one of Orange is the New Black's most layered characters? When we first meet Suzanne in season 1, she is Litchfield's resident weirdo, looked down upon by her fellow inmates and bestowed with the unfortunate, albeit apt nickname, Crazy Eyes. However, as the seasons progressed, we got to learn a little more about Suzanne's past and she slowly transitioned from comic fodder to one of the show's most beloved characters. If you love Time Hump Chronicles, please leave. 
played to perfection by Uzo Aduba. The actress won two Emmys for the role in 2014 and 2015, respectively. Number 4. Tasha Tasty Jefferson They call me tasty cause my pussy be delicious. Smart, well-read, and fiercely loyal to those she cares about, it's not hard to see why Tasty is such a popular Orange is the New Black character. From winning mock job fairs and standing up to V in the show's second season to scoring a cushy position as Caputo's secretary and later taking charge of the prison riot later in the series, Tasty has found herself at the center of some of the show's biggest story arcs, which isn't exactly surprising considering how talented actress Danielle Brooks is. Don't make me come back this and I swear to God! Number 3. Sophia Bursette I replenish my vitamin D so I don't get dementia. In a show known for its diverse cast of characters, few shine quite as brightly as Sophia, a trans woman locked up for stealing credit cards as a way to pay for her sex change. Sophia is one of Litchfield's friendliest inmates, just as long as you pay her the respect that she deserves. I don't have a lot left over for your hurt feelings. As the prison's resident hairdresser, Sophia gets to interact with many of the show's characters, making her one of the few people who can hop in and out of pretty much any scene. We love Sophia because she's forthright with her feelings and doesn't let anything get in the way of her relationship with her son. Baby, don't play tough <laughs> and watch your mouth. Number 2. Pusey Washington of all the shocking things that have happened over the course of the show's run, few can hold a candle to Pusey's death. It was a brutal end to one of Orange is the New Black's most beloved characters, and we're honestly still mourning. Her time on the show was filled with great moments between her and her fellow inmates, most notable of which was her relationship with Tasty. Pusey stands out for us because of her strong moral compass and easygoing personality. She loved to joke around with her friends and always stood up for what she believed in, and for that, will always hold her in the highest regard. I cried like a baby when Jenner died. You can't burn it. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. Hey, ladies, yo, get on the floor with your hands behind your head right now. Before I shoot your little friend here in the eyeball. You're for sale, so I'm purchasing your services. Just you know, check out, go to your happy place. I'll be quick. You break my heart. Number one, Galena Red Reznikov. There's the people who serve the bread and the people who eat the bread. From the first moment you meet her, Red is a force to be reckoned with at Litchfield. While she isn't afraid to dish out her own unique brand of justice, she's also an extremely sensitive and caring woman who acts as a mother figure to those around her. All I wanted was to eat the chicken that is smarter than other chickens and to absorb its power. The best characters are the ones who can make us laugh, cry, and cheer all in the same episode, something Red is more than capable of. While she's had her ups and downs, her feud with fellow Litchfield mother figure Gloria stands out. She always finds a way to land on her feet. I work with the Russian mafia. We make the Italians look like guppies. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo and subscribe for new videos every day.